Curtis Luck from Western Australia. Thanks for joining us. Now, Curtis, you uh, had a 68 today, four under, to move to seven under for the Golf SA Classic. Um, you had four birdies on the front nine, but unfortunately had a double uh, on the par five ninth. Yeah, just uh, made a little bit of a mess up around the green on uh, nine with a three putt to finish the hole. So, you know, fortunately I was able to get my head around it pretty quickly. Now, you followed up on the 10th and 11th uh, with birdie, so you did recover well. Yeah, no, I was uh, in position on 10 um, and hit a good approach shot in inside, like just to a couple of feet really, and then uh, 11 did the same. So yeah, no, bounced back really well, really happy about that. How did you find the conditions? Um, because it was a little bit breezy today and, and um, bits and pieces of uh, funny weather and, and a bit of drizzle here and there. Yeah, it, um, I think the tough thing today was the wind kind of was swirling a little bit out on the course, so I think we had a couple of changes in wind direction, which uh, made it a bit tough. So I think especially down the last couple, the wind was uh, slightly different to what it had kind of been playing all day, but that's all right. I think uh, most people dealt with that pretty well. Now you're in third place. Um, you're five off the lead, five behind Harrison uh, Endicott. Um, what are your plans for the final round tomorrow? Uh, well. Realistically, Harrison is showing that you know he's playing great golf at the moment. So um, there's nothing really but to go um, low. Really, that's all I can do. And you know whether that means I stand on the first tee and get a little bit more aggressive, or I just stick with what I do and hopefully hold a few more putts. Um, I don't know yet. I'll figure that out tonight, hopefully. But um, yeah, no, I think I'm definitely going to have to post a really good number tomorrow to be in contention. Great, thanks Curtis. All the best for tomorrow. Too easy, thanks.